Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to add 3D zoom in your CapCut, right? So I will show you each and everything through my tutorial, so just follow my steps. So to do that you will need just two or three images, for right now I have the, this one, right? And I want a sky, right? For example, this is a transparent one, this eagle you can see here right now. So how you can just make that transparent, you can see this is removed.bg. And this is a completely free AI website where you can just drop your image and it will remove your background in instantly. Now I just want a sky, right? So for example, let me show you. Uh, this is just for tutorial. So you can just download any of the images you like and you can just go for it. So I will like this one. So I will do one thing. I will just save it. And once I save, I will just go back to the CapCut. I will click on import. I will go wherever I have saved my two photos here. Right, so this is the first one. This is the sky, right? And so whatever the base, a background it is, you have to make sure to zoom it out. So you have to just go for the animation or something. And this is our second, which is the transparent eagle one, right? So here you can see this is right. Now, if I just choose this one. So guys here, make sure you select this background one, the sky, and I will just zoom it out, right? This is very important. And I will take the eagle and make sure this is this much, right? So you have to go to the start of the timeline, right? In the gap cut. Once you're here, make sure you just, you know, put your eagle like this and just go to wherever you want to have a zoom effect. Let's say I want to have a zoom effect here. This is a keyframe. So I'll just click on keyframe here, right? And I will get this eagle to here, right? And I will just zoom it out and I will add a keyframe here, right? So here you can see I've added two keyframes here. Let me just zoom it out for you. Right, so here I have added two keyframes. Right, now I will just go to the background here. And let's say I just want to have this background like this. And I will also add a, you know, here and I will add a keyframe like this. And once I get it here, right, it's very easy to do it. For example, let's say here, or I just want to drag a keyframe here exactly where I just want it, right? So for example, and this is a, just a tutorial, so make sure like this, right? Now I'll just play this video. For example, you can see this for Okay, so the eagle is not proper here, so I'll do one thing. I will just zoom it out like this, right? Now, I will just play this, right? You can do the same thing. You can just zoom in here. For example, let's take this one, and I will here like this. I will take this, right? Right, so you will, you can just get a better idea how to do it. And you can just add animation and depth to that image and everything like this. So in this way, you can just create, right? I hope you found this video very useful. If it did, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel and see you guys in the next video.